will turn it over to uh, Representative Lance Gooden. Lance so Gooden from Texas. Amen. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lance. Thank you all so much. And as Chip said yesterday, we had Alejandro Mayorkas in the House Judiciary. And when he wasn't uh, lying, just outright lying, he was refusing to answer our questions. And it was very frustrating. One of the things I heard him say and get praised by Democrats for was that the border is secure. If the border is so secure, what concern does this federal government have with what Greg Abbott is throwing in the river south of the Texas border? If the border is so secure, they should not, uh, they should not worry at all about what Gra Greg Abbott is doing. But I want to thank the governor for his efforts. We all stand behind him. We're very grateful. I also want to draw attention. border. Uh, they're providing financial assistance. They're putting people up in hotels. They're paying for plane tickets. And what they say is this is all done with private funds. But it's not true. And I couldn't get Secretary Mayorkas yesterday to admit that the government is spending money. We are actually sending taxpayer funds to these organizations. Catholic Charities is one of them. They've received over a billion dollars. Lutheran Family Services, Jewish Family Services. These are all organizations that have big fancy fundraisers in cities across America to raise private funds. But what they don't tell their donors and what they don't tell parishioners that are sending checks is that the federal government is spending over a billion dollars of taxpayer funds, sending it, them, sending it to them to then go to the border and encourage this crisis. They tell me I am misinformed and that I'm lying, but when word gets out across South America, up to Mexico, that there's a group waiting for them across the border to give them money, security, and uh, a passage to whatever city in America they want to go to, the word gets out and the immigration crisis continues. I join uh, Chip Roy in saying that I will not support any appropriations bill uh, that, that spends funds on these activities. I will not support American tax dollars uh, deliberately being used to fuel this crisis. And, you know, it's one thing that the federal government has refused to secure the border and Texas has had to spend so much money. It's another thing when they actually get in our way and tell us we have to stop securing our border. And so I stand with my colleagues here. I thank you uh, for your work, and we will continue to fight with you, Governor Abbott, and thank you for your work. Yes, sir. <coughs> Lance. Lance. Representative Jake Elsie.